Sagan for the win. Yes! A star is born in Tyler Sagan. The second pick overall in the 2010 round. Daly to Spencer looking in. Cranked and tipped in front. Sagan. up you never know how good he's going to be you always worry about the game and how everybody else is getting better Tyler wasn't a very big person he was, a little, he was very small but people used to say you know he was very gifted but as a family we never considered him to be a, a gifted player because we always wanted him to just get better Tyler always played up a year um, and his team never made the, into the championship day, which is Sunday. So Tyler said to, to me, he goes, Mama, you know what? I still want to go watch the hockey, even though we didn't make it in. I dropped him off at 8 o'clock in the morning because that was when the first game started. He stayed till 6 o'clock at night just watching hockey all day, even though he wasn't part of the uh, championship games. And he stayed there all day. And he did that a lot because he always wanted to be at the rink. Tyler wanted to get better in his skating when he was about 11 years old, and his skating was fine. But he wanted to be better, so he asked me if I would hire somebody, a skating coach. Once a week, I rented the ice, and I would take him at 7 o'clock in the morning before class, and we would go to a rink in Mayfield in Brampton, and I, he would go on the ice for an hour just to practice his skating, even though it was good. He just wanted to be better. I think we finally realized that he was going to be a good player and not necessarily make the NHL was when he had decided and he got accepted at University of Michigan and that's when he was going to go to school and play hockey but then we started getting knocks on the door saying you know he's uh, he's better than that he should be going to the OHL to get into the NHL just making it a faster route for him and that he was that good. So then we decided as a family we were going to um, decline on the uh, university um, offer and then we were going to, uh, he decided to go to the OHL but he still wanted to go to school um, so he wanted to go to school in Michigan. So that's when he ended up with the Plymouth Whalers and uh, after that he was two years in the OHL and he did so well that uh, he got drafted second overall to the NHL. With the second pick, the Boston Bruins select from the Plymouth Whalers, Tyler Sagan. So, and then he made the team, and then they won the Stanley Cup, which was just awesome. We didn't realize how great it was, and he didn't either, how great it was to actually win the Stanley Cup. Being such a young person, you don't realize how great it is. Now, you realize how great it is and how hard it is to get to the Stanley Cup again. Well, his success has affected us a lot. I mean, you know, we're more, well, especially with social media. Social media is crazy with, um, following our family, following me, following the girls um, when Tyler won the Stanley Cup or when they were playing Toronto uh, a couple years ago when Tyler played for Boston and we were in game seven. I mean the girls got, especially Cassidy, got um, people like in the school would, would taunt her and would call her out and say how bad her brother was as a player. Um, so, I mean, that was negative stuff. We had food thrown at us, you know. It, it, was, it's pre it was pretty bad. Even just recently, food was thrown at us. But, you know, we know how to handle that kind of stuff now. But, so that part of the fame was not fun. But the other part of the fame is just amazing. I mean, you know, we get a lot. We get a lot of perks. Um, we're very proud of Tyler. And uh, it's, it's, you know, we, we get to travel with him. Like we've done a lot of traveling through Europe when he plays for Team Canada. And uh, it's just, it's different, but yet it's real. It's reality too. I mean, he's still, we're all still the same. Nothing has changed. We're still people, you know, we're not, you know, we still go to the grocery store and buy groceries. I still make my bed. 
you know what I mean? Like I still clean my house and he's the same way. You know, it's, it's great that he, he's so popular and famous, but it's also still, he's still our son at the end of the day and the brother.